Hello everyone, and welcome back to Truth Real Truth Audio. Today I'm going to be speaking on Bedru of Japan, a supposed parallel with Jesus Christ. This will be read from a script, by the way, as you can tell from my glances over at my computer screen. Alright, let's get right into this. Bedru of Japan is a myth, plain and simple. We have no evidence that he, or she, probably not, ever existed. So let's not even try to say that he had anything in common with Jesus. But I am not going to just sit here and spout random crap out of my mouth. I am actually going to back up my statements up by facts, unlike the people who use the Bedroom of Japan pagan parallels argument. Like RJS. Um, I think that's how you say it. In the name Bedru, there are two problems with this name to claim that it, that it originated in Japan. First of all, the syllable Dru, D-R-U, is not allowed in the Japanese language. D-R-U, it's not allowed in the Japanese language. Plain and simple. And second of all, the double D combination is also not known in the modern Japanese language, as in D-D. B-E-D-D-R-U. The D-R-U at the end uh, isn't allowed in Japanese language, and the D-D, double D combination, is not known in the modern Japanese language. This, added with the fact that we have no positive evidence for his existence, or her, probably not, leads me and should lead any rational person to admit that Bedru of Japan uh, never did in fact, never did in fact exist, nor did he have anything in common with Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. Thank you all, and good night for now.